an easy to use crypto payments app that's as simple as Square Cash or Venmo with smart contract execution handled by the wallet. Sounds too good to be true, right? Wrong. It's here, it's called Vivo Pay, and it's being built on Harmony. Let's dig in. So if you came to blockchain in 2019, you might have been forgiven for thinking the space was a little quiet. The narrative that Ethereum can't handle volume kind of dies when there's no volume to support it, but then Whammy! DeFi hit the afterburners and you got it. Suddenly that narrative is back and Twitter is ablaze with outrage and told you so's. More volume means more users, means more adoption, but of course it comes at a cost, literally. Literally. And look, I'll be the first to put my hand up and say right here that the ETH killer's narrative is stupid and unhelpful. But let me put it this way. I live in Holland. The whole country is at risk of flooding all the time. But it's protected by a vast network of barriers and dikes. Now there had to be a major disaster before the country properly invested to stop that ever happening again. And that's where we're at with Ethereum. We can all pretend it's not a problem, but it is. Which is why smart solutions that address the very real high cost of gas should be top of everyone's list when it comes to building meaningful applications for adoption. Now let's look at this gas thing. Gas exists because the minor computing power needed to execute smart contracts is a limited resource. There's a limited number of miners, and to keep the network safe, all miners do the same work. If a user invokes a smart contract, that contract is executed with the user's input by every single miner in the network. Running smart contracts on miners is both wasteful and a bottleneck because, well, it isn't even necessary. Now you try explaining gas price and gas limit to a fresh-faced crypto newbie and watch them go running back to their freshly minted fiat toilet paper. Gas is a major pain in the ass UX problem. Like, a big one. This is a big one. Big one. I want the big one. Yeah, that's fine. Some wallets and DeFi front ends have softened the blow by paying gas fees for their users. And while commendable, it's really just an introductory offer. It's not sustainable and it doesn't last, especially when gas and transaction costs surge. In other words, Ethereum's greatest successes are also its greatest pitfalls. And that brings us very neatly to VivoPay. The idea is to make blockchain the way we all believe it should be. Cheap, simple, safe, and fast. But how does VivoPay solve the gas problem? Well, basically, it will move smart contract execution from miners to wallets by securely running the smart contracts on your computer using zero-knowledge proofs, which have been a running fascination for all the galaxy brain in the space for years now. Long seen as a kind of mythical impossibility right on the fringe of what was possible, we're now seeing viable products enter the market, such as ZK Rollups, from the likes of Matalabs. And yeah, zero knowledge proofs are pretty wild. So let's just take a moment to explain how they work. Well, how does it work? Let's say I'm in possession of a secret piece of information in this box, and I want to share it with you. However, I want to do it in a way that wouldn't require me to directly share the secret, revealing what I have or how much I have of it, simply because you might be able to use that secret to your advantage. In this case, the only thing I can do is to prove to you that I am in fact in possession of a secret without unveiling the secret itself. <coughs> Sounds simple, but it's one of cryptography's greatest party tricks. Like David Copperfield making the Statue of Liberty disappear. David Copperfield, really? Never seen a Statue of Liberty disappear. Now let's hear from the inventors Ronald Manick and Mitchell Krawiak to see how this principle comes into play with VivoPay. We noticed that new to crypto users have problems going through the process of uh, running down the seed phrase and all that you have to do with, with normal wallets. So we want to make that easier for new users while keep the secure way of onboarding for experienced users. Zero Knowledge Plus are a revolutionary new technology that will enable blockchains to have like more capacity, so more transactions per second. You have to pay less gas, and it's a way to add privacy to blockchain. The 
idea is that the way smart contracts work right now is kind of wasteful and we want to bring like the execution of smart contracts to the wallet meaning that instead of having every miner in any blockchain calculating like these smart contracts over and over again what we want to have is like if i want to start a transaction and invoke a smart contract I run that smart contract on my own computer within my own wallet and I share the results of that computation with the blockchain and that is way faster, way easier than running these smart contracts on chain. This is a very secure way. Zero Knowledge Proofs make sure that you cannot like cheat with these kind of calculations. What we will have as well are programming tools. So we're working in parallel to, to VivoPay on programming tools so that developers can easily port their existing smart contracts to these kind of new zero knowledge proof smart contracts for VivoPay. VivoPay is a perfect example of why the grants program exists, to identify smart, savvy teams building products that solve a genuine problem and supporting them in bringing them to life. Now, what's actually in this box? Yeah.